Well, welcome back to another AimLab guide. This time we're going to take a look at how to create a custom task. Custom tasks are a great way to customize your training and allow you to take more control. To get to custom tasks option, simply click custom from the top of the main menu and click tasks. When you're on the section, the menu allows you to select from a few preset tasks from different training categories. To get started, simply select the training task you want to modify and then click customize task. For the example, we'll be customizing spider shot. The first thing you want to do is to name your training task. I've called mine custom spiders, but you can call it more specifically to what the modifications of the task are. This way you can save it and come back to it later. You can also set the time duration for the task. Normally tasks are set to 60 seconds, but this can be increased all the way up to 600 seconds. This allows you to train on the task for much longer. The next setting size mode allows you to modify how the targets appear. Setting this to AI will allow you to set a minimum and maximum target size and the sizes will dynamically change based on your performance. Setting this to fixed will keep the targets always at a set size and random will randomly select one of the two other options when you train. Similar to the size mode, the speed mode will allow you to change how quickly or slowly the target will appear and disappear. The targets will dynamically change duration using the AI function based on how well you are doing along with having a fixed option allowing you to set the duration to your choosing. With the AI function you can also set the minimum and maximum duration of the targets. After setting the mode of your choice you can then tweak the target sizes and speed settings below to your choosing along with the target distance and target health. For each number you increase on the target health is one extra shot you'll need to do before taking down the target. For example in this video the target has 4 health. Now we're at the juicy part, I'm sure you've heard of or have to improve your left side weakness where you can adjust the locations of the targets which spawn by clicking the positions on or off. If the area is red, the targets are off and if the green, the targets are active. If you want to practice on just one side, simply click off the left or the right side. This clip for example which we saw at the start of the video has targets only appearing on the right side of the screen which allows you to train specifically here if you need to improve. By zoning in on what you actually need to improve, you'll be able to get results quicker. After you finish customizing your task, simply click save changes. If you want to find the task that you've just saved, from the main task menu click the my save tasks in the top right side, here you can play or edit the task. To change your weapon or the map location, simply just click on the drop downs and select the desired one. I hope you found this video useful, you can now get results quicker by customizing your training tasks. If you have, make sure to drop a thumbs up, subscribe to the AimLab YouTube for more custom tutorial content, and also follow over on social media because we serve some of the freshest memes and some of the best pro plays. Until next time, happy training.